Did you ever got frustrated by cables that got tangled? This is Frederick from the techno label Detroit Berlin and in this video I will share 5 tips to get cables untangled or to prevent them from getting tangled in the first place. If you're new to the channel, please consider to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up. Tip 1. Never pull but slightly loosen the cables otherwise you will damage the cables and you will only make it more difficult to untangle your cables never pull just slightly loosen and the cables will untangle themselves just like this tip 2 try to avoid putting the end of the cable through the cable mess because probably you will make more nuts than there's already in there. Try to pull the ends out of the cable mess, don't put them through because you will make more nuts by trying to pull them out of the cable mess, you avoid making more nuts than are already in the cable mess. Here you go. Tip 3. Try to do it on the floor in a well-lighted environment. Doing it on the floor and in a well-lighted place will make it so much easier because you can actually see what you are doing. Tip 4. Have patience. Try to be patient and try to relax a little bit even when there's time pressure. Then the cables will untangle much faster than when you like really nervously shaking the cables because that will probably not work. Tip 5. Avoid to get cables tangled in the first place. If you have some cables, what I like to do is have a few cables, have a nut in them and then you can hang these cables on hooks or place them in a box and this way try to have all cables at the same place because otherwise the weight of all the cables will damage the cable so have it like this or even better hang them with the nut itself and don't tighten the nut too much because then you will also damage your cables. Cables might seem thick but when you pull cables, when you make nuts, those cables will get damaged. So how do cables actually get tangled? You have a box, you have cables, you drop them in the box without having some, some cable straps around the cables, you just put them in the box. Then another time you need a cable, so you kind of, you just try to pull the cable out, it gets tangled or it is tangled or you throw the cables in the box around which tangles the cables. Afterwards you have the cable and you need to be quick so you, you take the cable and you put it in the box and the next time there is somebody that wants another cable and you've got a cable mess. You will lose a lot of time by being chaotic with cables. Like I mentioned I like to take a few cables, I will make a nut and I will put them down or I will hang them up on a hook. I try to keep it pretty tidy so when I need a cable I just go to my cable hooks, I pull the cables from the hooks and I untie the nut and I've got my cables still in pristine condition. And especially don't let cables just dangle because when you take a cable, you put it back, you're actually like, yeah, you're braiding. So the, the cables get tangled this way and afterwards if you need a cable, you will put pressure on the cable because the cables are rubber and when you pull them and they are entangled even when you pull them in the same direction you will put pressure on the cables themselves and like I mentioned the wire that uh, transports the signal that's very 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 thin in most cases so when you 
pull on those cables too much, it might give a bad contact and it might interrupt a little bit until you twist the cable again. And that's something extremely annoying. And most of the cases it comes from cables that, yeah, have too much pressure on them. If you have a really long cable, the weight of the cable can already damage the wire inside that yeah, carries the signal. So please be careful for that. If you enjoyed this, give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Also got a Patreon, so if you want to support me in making more videos of this kind, please take a look at my Patreon and join me there. Put some comments in the comment section down below. Share your thoughts and yeah, see you soon. Bye bye.